Uh, I'm Davey. I'm the vocalist of Vanna, and this is how music saved my life. Um, I started playing music when I was like 11 years old, I guess. I was, started drumming in a, a little punk band when I was in uh, middle school. And, uh, you know, I'd go to Warp Tour and go to, you know, see MXPX and uh, No Effects. And uh, my stepfather it was my drum teacher also. So he brought me to lots of shows and stuff. So anytime I could go to a concert or a show or a festival or anything like that, we always tried to go. I think that, you know, everyone says, you know, well, times are changed and times are different. And, you know, um, growing up still growing up. Things still suck. Things are still fucked up. And... You know, families still get disjointed. Um, you know, kids still feel disconnected from their school, from sports, from their friends, from their family. And uh, I know that the one thing that never left me is music. Um, you know, it's, it will never turn its back on you. It's always there. You can run to it. And, you know, um, you don't feel at home in your group of friends or whatever and you really like music and stuff like that, go to shows and maybe meet some new friends who feel exactly like you do. And, uh, you know, there are other people out there that feel exactly the same, you know. Um, you know, life, life sucks. And uh, it's about finding those things in life to make you happy. Um, and those connections with people and could be bands, could be anything really. But uh, it's all about just finding that connection that brings you through all the bad shit and makes you feel good. And when I was in my um, early 20s, I kind of hit this like rock bottom point of I broke up with a girlfriend I was dating for four years. I lost a job. Um, and I didn't really know, you know, I, my friends sort of, I was alienating. I was alienating myself from my friends um, because of all the changes happening in my life. And, um, you know, I was kind of using, um, you know, getting drunk and sort of, you know, or getting high or whatever to kind of escape all that shit and uh, I had so many thoughts of like suicide and so many times where I wondered if anyone would even miss me like if I woke up and I didn't wake up and I died how long would it take for anyone to even notice um, you know and looking back on that now I know that you know it would affect people and you know people did love me it's just I was alienating myself because of the way that I felt and uh, I know that the only thing that kept me like going and kept me kind of away from that is playing in a band um i we had shows like almost every weekend and uh i think that kept me focused on other things and uh it slowly but surely has pulled me out of that sort of depression i was in all i mean even in, when i was in that band all i did was talk about how depressed i was and um it's funny because no one really sees it until now no one looks back on it until now and they say oh wow you were really bummed out uh, but it's because I didn't share it with anybody. And if I could, you know, say anything to anyone, I would say tell somebody because chances are there are people that care. You just don't know it because you're pushing them away, you know, subconsciously or purposely or whatever. But um, I do know that music for me definitely saved my life. And being in a band definitely saved my life. And now I'm at such a good point. I'm so glad I stuck around. And, uh, you know, hopefully I could you know, try to convince other people to stick around too. I want everybody to know that life's worth it. It gets better. Um, you know, come to a show, come hang out. I'll talk to you for fucking hours about whatever you want to talk about because it does get better. It does improve. You got to make the change in yourself, but it does get better.